So real quick, I just figured I'd make this uh, generally uh, informative, hopefully, video for you. Um, but first thing you need to know when you're kind of working on your own boat is what outdrive do you have? You know, like what, what in this instance, Mercruiser outdrive do you have? And so um, basically there's Alpha drives and Bravo drives, and that's the two most common ones. Bravos, I kind of think of them as like a three-quarter ton truck compared to a half-ton truck. You know, they're like the heavier-duty the higher power rated um, versions. So um, those Bravo drives, um, what we're looking at here is an Alpha Gen, Alpha 1 Gen 2. So Alpha would be the name of the drive. Um, that's like kind of the series of drive. And then there was a Gen 1 and a Gen 2. Bravos are like the big dogs, you know? And so the difference between a Bravo and an Alpha just by looking at it is basically an Alpha has this part's like almost straight up and down. You know, you can see the flange where the bell housing mounts. Those are like just about parallel. But if you look on a Bravo drive, it actually goes like down and it continues off. There's a lot more beef in this area, so it, it just looks different. If you get used to seeing them, you'll, you'll notice the difference. That's the way that I kind of can look at them and, and tell pretty much right away what I'm looking at. Then uh, this is an Alpha drive. I already said that, Alpha 1 Gen 2. So um, the difference between the Gen 1 and Gen 2, there's uh, differences in parts. The seals don't work, some of them. Um, just you got to know what you got. So basically um, the easiest way I found to look at an Alpha and know whether it's a Gen 1 or a Gen 2 is based on this trim um, ram uh, pivot point right there so basically on a gen 2 there's a fair amount of distance between the corner and the pivot point you know i'd say that's i don't know at least you know three or four inches on a gen 1 there is basically no distance it's like this part is like right here out on the end so that's probably the easiest way that you can uh, identify a gen 1 from a gen 2 um, and then also uh my understanding is that on a gen 1 uh like right here, see how this is like kind of swept back? It's kind of slant cut. And then this here is vertical. On an Alpha 1 Gen 1, it would be straight cut, not swept back like this. It'd be just straight, the skeg is. And then same up top here, you can see um, there's like a little bit of an angle right there that goes carries all the way up there. Well, anyway, that would be straight, generally straight. So um, that's kind of a more subtle difference. But um, anyway, I think the best way is to is to look at that pivot point so for the pros out there maybe catching this video if you uh, if you have a better way let me know because I'd be curious myself but that's uh, probably the the best way to know what you got of course you can see Alpha Bravo they definitely have their stickers but a lot of times they get repainted and that sticker would be gone and and then therefore you wouldn't know so anyway hope hope this helps you out and uh, thanks for watching